Ladies and gentlemen, Sigurd has arrived in Assassin's Creed Rebellion. The event for him has just finished. I managed to bag myself a four star, exactly a four star, there you go. But by the skin of my teeth, managed to get a four star. So today we are gonna take him out for a little bit of a test run. We're gonna see how he performs. Is he the new Alvero? We don't know, Alvero is a very good epic AOE uh, hero. Um, but obviously there's Musa as well, but we don't really include him. Uh, but can Cigar perform well? Well, we'll find out in this video. First of all, before I go any further, thank you ever so much for all the support on the Cigar giveaway, the Intel Room pool battle, the love you've been showing the channel and the Intel Room of late. It's just been fantastic. It really has been. The community at the minute just seems so boisterous and friendly and together and it's just been really nice to be a part of so thank you ever so much for that right so let's get into his abilities right the first ability he's got is the main is that oh god here we go should have practiced this maiming sweep we'll go with that strikes all enemies inflicting 200 percent bleed damage over six ticks so obviously i only have him at four star he's only got tier four gear so obviously with t5 gear this could be a nice bleed so We'll see how that goes, especially when he's completely T5'd out. See quite how, how well he'll do. Let's see. Right, so Raider's Strike. So strikes all enemies two times for 90% damage. So basically a watered down version of female A4. She hits six times, but she only hits for, I think it's 60% of her attack or 40% of her attack. But it's just ridiculous anyway. So this is kind of a watered down version of that, but it's still nice to have, guaranteed two hits. If you do some nice damage, yeah, you should hopefully take them out fairly quickly. Retaliate as well. Now this is what I like about him. A lot of the AOE heroes are very squishy. GLMO, extremely squishy. Alvero, extremely squishy. So for him to have this retaliate ability, just helps him stay in a fight so much longer and obviously deal damage back while reducing what the incoming damage is as well. That's quite nice. It's got a couple of passive abilities. Attack is increased by 30% when fighting multiple enemies. And defense is increased by 35% while uh, fighting multiple enemies. That's quite nice. So, yeah, it does look like that this hero's got a little bit more defense about them um, compared to some of the other AoEs. But we'll find out. We're going to take him into a mission here. Now, this is Story 23, um, the last mission of Region 4. It is a little bit above his power level, but we're going to go in. We're going to see what it's like. I mean, you know, this should really be should really be a level thirty nine minimum. Um, but we'll go. We'll go in. We've got a healer. We'll just see what he can do. We'll see what fun he can have, and we'll yeah, just see how he performs. Obviously, being a longsword hero as well isn't ideal. His, his weapon speed will be very slow, so they are going to get quite a few attacks off on us, but. We'll see how it goes now. Right, we'll take Sigurd in. It says it's easy. Right, let's smack this fella. We don't want to use our abilities on him yet because there's two enemies. Now, this is the only issue he's got. When you've got somebody who attacks very quickly in front of you, you take a hell of a lot of damage. Sometimes getting the bleed off and then taking a couple of whacks afterwards isn't really worth it. But what should we go for? Let's go for this, see if we can KO him. Yeah, there you go. Absolutely KO'd him. Obviously, when you hit someone with the bleed ability, it doesn't do much damage because it's all about the damage over time effect. So, yeah, it's not the best. So we're going to use the bleed ability here because he's going to ring the bell and hit us. Just standard. He's going to do it. But he's not taking too much damage, to be fair to you. These enemies are quite a bit higher than him, and he's not doing too bad. And he's absolutely mowed them down. I mean... Is he going to hit as hard as Alvero? We don't know until he is actually equipped with T5 gear. But at the minute, he looks fairly promising, to be honest with you. As I said, the double swing, always nice. Um, should we just heal him up? Just give him a little bit of a Nats Cock Elf. Now, let's jump in here. So obviously, he's fast. So do we really want to start off with the bleed? Probably not, because we're going to get hit twice because we'll probably lose initiative. And then we're going to get hit twice again. So I'm probably more than likely going to go for this. Just to do maximum damage and then get him down that way. I think that might be best case scenario. 
We've got two enemies again here. We can use the bleed here. We'll use it here, see how it goes. Let's heal him up again. Probably be best to actually bring two healers in, but here we go. So we'll give this fella a little smack from behind. Not bad damage, 800, that's not bad. I mean, considering some of the legendaries at five star, um, you know, with five star gear only hit for about one and a half K, it's not too bad. Obviously they're not AOE heroes, but it's still quite nice. We'll get the retaliate up, obviously this will help protect ourselves. We're gonna get the bleed off because there's a fella behind. The This ability isn't gonna one shot them, so we might as well get the bleed off, do a bit of damage over time. As you can see, it doesn't hit that hard. It's all about the residual effect, the bleed effect afterwards. But we'll get this down. That's hurt him. And now, we'll if we don't miss, bang, clean him up for the win. So not too bad at all, if I do say so myself. Right Now, this will be a little bit tricky. I've actually failed this quite a few times doing this room. That's if I can get into it. But if we get into it, we've got two big fights but then he's got a dexterity check which isn't his forte unfortunately but we got in nice one Sigurd well done I think I may have said Sigurdsson through some of this video I do apologize I don't know why I keep getting it mixed up but right we're going to get because he's a slow enemy in front of us he's going to hit hard but we might as well get the bleed off because that will do some damage to the fella behind we got our retaliate up that was quite nice Get this ability off. We've killed him behind, retaliated him here, bleeds, taking him down. Absolutely fantastic. That couldn't have gone better. But right, obviously we're going to take a bit of damage here because we're exhausted as well. So we're going to take you know, our defense is reduced by 30%. This fella's quite hard. We will get the bleed off on him just because it may help us out a bit. Now get the retaliate up. That was a nice bit of damage. And that's just ticking him away. And look at that. I don't think we can heal him anymore. No, Sigurd is completely out of heals, but that's all right. We'll give it a go. Let's go up here. Uh, all right, I think I've got to do a jump down here. That's the only issue. Uh, is there another room down here? Oh, Jesus. Right, he's probably going to get his butt whooped down there, but we'll give it a go. Why not? I mean, what's it matter? Might as well give it a go. But for the end, for this being reach end of last mission of region four, he's done. He's oh, he's only one person in here, right? If we can get the retaliate up, oh, they've seen us. If they didn't see us, we could have got a little sneaky attack off there. I mean, this. Oh, 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 it looks like we've got both of these to go off coming after us now. Uh, right, Ramirez is going to say something. We're not going to let him finish. He gets cheeky stab from behind. He's like, what's going on? This bloke's a little rascal. Yeah, that's it. Run after him. Little rascal. Right. We're going to take... How much health have we got? Oh, right. We could get one shot here. This bloke's going to hit extremely hard. We're still exhausted. But we'll get the bleed off. Oh, oh what a dodge, Sigurd. What a dodge. Get that off. Oh, he's dodged again. No need to retaliate. Oh, and the bleed took him down. Look at that. Sigurd completed the mission. What a boy. What a boy. Absolutely phenomenal. I'm pleasantly surprised by that. Really pleasantly surprised by that. That is, that's just immense. That really is. I mean, a four star level 31 taking on that. I mean, we healed him up a fair bit. Little bit of RNG went our way, but. That's well decent, well decent. Absolutely pleasantly surprised by that. That's the first time I've done that. Uh, I've been testing him out a little bit. Never quite got through that, but you know, we came good in the end. I mean, if we do the last mission here, I mean, I think he'll steamroll this if you want my truthful opinion. Uh, let's heal him up. Got to help use a health potion, but for you, I will do it. I do not mind giving you a health potion. Why? Because I love his all. Right, this should be fairly good for him, in all fairness. I'm still, I am pleasantly surprised. I think he could be a very good hero, t 5 out, very good hero. Uh, what's his agility like here? Oh, his agility is even shocking here. Right, let's use Edward here. There's a few people we can go and bash up. So let's just use this. This isn't the Edward show. 
it's a cigar show right so here we go this is what we want someone who's going to ring that bell pull him in here i mean their health pools are quite a bit lower uh if we just use this ability that is they're going to go down i'll get hit a couple of times well i've dodged both of them get wrecked get absolutely wrecked uh right for a bit of fun come up here we might as well hit this fella because oh the other bloke comes running over straight away damn it if that was the case but that's the, that's what you can see when you're up against quick enemies you you can half get hit quite a few times before you get an attack off and that's the only thing where he fails i think that's the only if i had an issue with him that would be the only issue but that comes with all longsword heroes and until he's t5'd out we really don't know how i can't believe i failed that and i took damage what i mean his attack isn't bad i can at least bash his chest open uh this should just kill him outright yeah as i said that's just a watered down version of female avil's ability but it's still fairly decent um go up here i mean this will be food and drink again this will just be spinny spinny take him out bang he's done uh right what's down here there's no enemies we've got to take out down here is there now so we can just leap a faith off of this and then we've got two rooms and as i said he'll breeze it we've not even had to heal him yet not even had to heal him uh, i don't think we will in all fairness there's one enemy here uh let's get the bleed off on him might as well we got initiative because we're up against like another longsword so we won that uh longsword battle and he's down there you go absolutely minced absolutely means i think we've got two enemies here we're gonna throw i love it everyone gets a fry knife get your free fry knife in this chapter bang doesn't matter whether you're a viking an assassin a doctor or nakatas get a fry knife and then this fella's gonna come over we're gonna bleed him because he's a beefy enemy might as well have that going off right we're gonna get the retaliate up hopefully take away some of the rigid like main hits he's doing and we've got him down look at that in the bin so yeah fairly happy with him good addition to the game obviously he is usable in the campaign because he doesn't feature in it um so female avor and male avor are banned from the campaign i think jora is banned for one mission because it's not even her name in it but she's in it um so as long as you can use her in another mission but yeah to get through like number 15 mission 15 like all the fives going through the campaign him maxed out i don't think he'll struggle with i don't think he'll struggle with mission 20 especially if you take a healer in i think he'll have that all day long well i hope you enjoyed the video assassins let me know what you think of your first thoughts of sigard you all take care good night and have a fantastic day